All right, gamers, welcome back to another epic episode of Modded Minecraft. Today I'm going to make some roads for all of us to travel on with our vehicles, which uh, requires some charcoal, which is what Joe got for Christmas. Oh, uh, wait a minute, I don't have a vehicle. Well then, get one loser. Even if I knew how to make a vehicle in this godforsaken mod pack, I'm still fucking stuck in this damn city dimension. Joe, I literally put down a waystone for you last time, but uh, I guess it's my fault for thinking you would actually remember the coordinates or write them down. Yeah, so uh, where the fuck is it then? Well, uh, I don't remember the exact numbers, but I know it was somewhere around 3,000 and 1,000. Didn't you just get done making fun of me for most likely not remembering the chords that you told me last time? Yes, but I also said it was my fault for thinking you would write them down. And if you can barely pick up a beach chair, then I know you can't pick up a simple pen. Okay, so uh, where is the waystone again? Ugh, Joe, you are so fucking... Never mind, uh, just look at the mini-map at the top right corner of the screen. There should be a waystone icon and you can just follow it. Oh, okay, I think I see it. Good thing Jill shoved those contacts in my eyes this morning. She ought to shove some stupid pills down your gullet, too. Oh, hey, George, haven't heard you say anything today yet. Watch you think about adding roads to each of our houses, since you're the only other one with a vehicle right now. Um, I could care less about roads, honestly, especially since you don't need roads for ships. Besides, why not add a road to my awesome Texas roadhouse? Bro, I paid someone to build that for you like a month ago, and you haven't done anything to it. Well, I think it was a bad marketing strategy, since none of y'all are willing to give me diamonds for steak, since you can just kill cows for free. Diamonds for steak? That's a big expensive, don't you think? Yes, bitch, and that's a bargain, since in Joe's economy, you need like 10 blocks of netherite to afford half a steak. That's fake news, George. Steak is really cheap, thanks to President Harris, and uh, we added jobs last month, I think. Oh, and steak is expensive, thanks to Donald. That made about as much sense as Velma being renewed for a second season. Donald is spitting facts. Wait, what's this about a fax machine? I'm the fax machine, a big old machine full of facts and no lies whatsoever. Said every lying politician in existence. I think I'm gonna head over to the stronghold, see what the new end dimension looks like, and maybe get some end city armor since I have all these overpowered inventory pets, but shit armor. Yeah, well, no one gives a flying fuck. What's the point of us playing a modded MC server together if we aren't gonna talk about what we are doing? Um, yo mama. Hmm. This asphalt here looks like the stone texture, but with a touch of Obama. Up yours, you fucking dickweed. What in the cow kick in hell is a dickweed? Yeah, bro, that sounds pretty painful to shove that now legal substance up a penis. Dickweed means a stupid and obnoxious man. Oh shit, there's glow squid there. Kill him with fire. Ha ha ha. I did something better than kill them with fire. How? A drone strike like usual? No, you fucking asshole. I use my cloud pet to strike them with lightning. While barracks striking things with lightning instead of drones, some serious character development going on. If only your orange brain fully developed. Oh no, the master of smooth talk and empty promises insulted me. Let me tell you something, Barry. I may be orange, but at least my brain's not filled with the same old recycled ideas that you've been spewing for years. While you're busy playing basketball, I was out there making deals and building empires, so I've got a way more developed brain than any of you pathetic NPC politicians. Speaking of recycled ideas, aren't you the one always saying the wall? The wall, the wall. Why did you say the wall three times? Because maybe the fat genie was gonna pop out and do us all a favor and shave your crazy ass hair. What the fuck? Wall. Oh, wait a minute, I gotta make my duo eye bigger. My contacts are wearing off. Ooh. Now what the fuck is going on here? These weird cubes are shooting at me. Wait, what? The Mies are in the Lost Cities Dimension 2? Oh, so that's what these motherfuckers are called. Why do they seem so familiar? Because back in episode 70, Donald decided to be a jackass like usual and install a crazy mod that wreaked havoc on all our houses, forcing us to switch to an older backup. Something that always happens every 10 goddamn sessions, so we might as well do nothing on episode 80. Hey, the Me Alliance mod is pretty fucking cool, though. Much more interesting than your personality. Fuck you, Donald. Wait, we've been doing this horrible fucking crap for nearly 80 episodes? Well, I've only been a part of it for 25. It took Obama blowing up Donald's gaming PC and destroying the old server to get me fucking invited. Yeah, that's because you're boring as hell, too. Oh, fuck. These guys make so many out-of-pocket sounds. I'm surprised you even know the term out-of-pocket, Joe. I don't know, it was on my teleprompter. Whoa, what the hell? Officer Chummy, that's a new one. 
Hey, fuck off, you stupid Cyclops. What? Why are you attacking me? I was fucking helping you bitches. Just like 2001. Whoa, dude, the new end dimension is sick. Did the end dimension not wear a mask? Oh my god, you're so fucking stupid, Joe. Oh, fuck. Oh, Jesus Christ, they have a whole fucking army after me. Shit, I better get the fuck out of here. But I thought these guys were supposed to be good. Ha, you can't get me from up here, losers. Oh, what the fuck is this shit? Oh my god! Uh, they can fucking build? This shit is fucking crazy. The fuck kind of mod is this? I'm literally having a build battle with white cubes. Well, then just build back better. Shut up, butt wipe! Holy butt pimples, they can build just as fast as me. Holy butt pimples, really? You gotta find better expressions, fuck face. Yeah, I don't fucking care, Donald. Okay, this shit is actually so fucking cursed. I don't even know how they modded something like this. Whoa, I just found a strange tunnel. Holy shit! Those me things are down here too. Oh fuck, it's building over to me. Let's go, I captured the big guy with a bucket. But I thought Sleepy Joe was called the big guy. Uh, the fuck you talking about? You're the one that's as big as the, uh, um... I can't quite think of something funny at the moment, but you're huge. Wow, Joe calling me huge is so original. Anyways, I think I'm gonna take a break from building roads and maybe craft another vehicle. Ooh, I think I'll make a golf cart. A golf cart? Really, Donald? The fuck you gonna do, make a golf course in Minecraft? Perhaps? Me, me. Oh, fuck, my game froze. Ha ha, get wrecked, bitch. Me, me, Man, these guys me, just won't quit. Me, 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 oh, crap, my game froze, too. Did you guys buy your PCs from a hobo or some shit? Donald, we are kind of running close to 400 mods installed. It's ludicrous to think the game won't freeze every once in a while. Yeah, well, I get brain freeze all the time. That's because you shove ice cream down your wrinkly throat every goddamn day. Fuck! Damn, these motherfuckers are strong. I'm getting the hell out of this weird-ass tunnel. Oh, fuck, they are guarding the entrance. God damn it, why did I think taking my car out for a drive would be a good idea? Yeah, shame on you, George. Now the water will rise and it will, uh, you know, change the thing over time about one or two degrees and, uh, hey, Jill, can you get me some toilet paper, please? Let's fucking go! I finally got some damn armor. Bro, we are 26 episodes into this new server, and you still don't have any kind of good modded armor? That's the whole point in adding thousands upon thousands of new fucking items, Barry. I deadass don't care. Oh, what the fuck? This one is wearing a red banner. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. These guys are more annoying than Donald's Truth Social posts. Hey! Okay, so where's the other white sheep? I just need two more white wool. Oh, shit! This sheep did the reverse Michael Jackson. Let's fucking go. I finally found the waystone. Now I can get out of this god-awful place. Wait, this is what my house looks like? I don't remember it looking like this. Well, unfortunately, Joe, it's still as shitty as your administration. Maybe if you took your goddamn dementia pills for once, you would have remembered that and maybe change up the ugly-ass Shrek floor that you have. Yeah, well, shut up. What in the hanky-ass cow-kicking bullshit is this? Now they're placing beacons around here? What's next? They are gonna build like a whole civilization or some shit? Actually, I did read up somewhere that they can do that in the Me Alliance mod. Are you fucking kidding me? I think I'm gonna build a nice archway out of these mistroom pillars. Oh shit, a creeper. Fuck off. Okay, now back to this, uh, I forget what it's called. Actually, this looks a little too awkward. I wonder how I'm gonna do this. Holy ball sacks. I accidentally brought out my ender bow. What the fuck is that? Oh, it's just a bow that teleports you to wherever you shoot the arrow. Does that mean if I shoot at the sun, I teleport to the sun dimension? What kind of stupid ass fucking question is that, Joe? Um, a question. Let's fucking go! Yeah, I finally crafted my golf cart. If you were still president, I would say congratulations. Now you can just golf every damn day instead of doing presidential things. Like you always used to do. Bitch, I golfed way less than Joe going to Delaware. And besides, you don't have to worry, because next year I'll be president and a golfing champion at the same time yet again. In your dreams, you fat slob. 
You ain't getting near the White House. Your only chance is building one in the game. Well, Barrack, unfortunately, your ugly husband isn't running, so I'm favored to win. Favored to win what exactly? World's biggest pumpkin? Okay, shut the fuck up, ass munch. All right, I just crafted the Illuminati pet. Isn't that the creepy eye on the dollar bill? Wait, what? The Illuminati is on the dollar? That's wild. I can't believe that no one told me such thing. Aside from Joe's stupid comment, what does the Illuminati pet do exactly? It gives a random item whenever you right click. What the hell? It didn't give me an item. So it didn't do what it was supposed to do? Every politician in a nutshell. I know, right? Whoa, what the fuck? Me seedlings? Grows a me once harvested. Hmm, seems cool. Wait, what? You can grow those little shits? Can I have that so that I can maybe have one defend of the others because they are always after me these days? No, get your own pal. Oh, come on, you greedy old buffoon. What do you want for it? Um, how about you don't make fun of me for an entire episode? That may just be harder than winning the 2000 election, but, uh, yeah, I guess it's a deal. All right, nice doing business with you. Does this episode count? Well, no, I guess it would be next session because I may have to get off in a few minutes to take a nap. Oh, okay, well then, it's pretty pathetic, Joe, that your idea of a good trade is not making fun of your sorry ass. Who needs comedy shows when we have you, the king of slip-ups and mispronunciations? And your fucking obsession with ice cream is really cringe, but maybe it's because your policies leave such a bitter taste in people's mouths that you're trying to make up for it by sweetening the deal. Oh, and BTW, your cognitive decline is truly impressive. It's like watching a goddamn turtle try to outrun a cheetah. I thought I had some verbal slip-ups now and then, but you take it to a whole new level and your accomplishments are so sparse, they make a desert look like a lush garden. Holy shit, George, you really be cooking. Hey, well, I had to get it out of me before. I try to do the impossible and not make fun of the clown of the year, 40 years running. I really hate you, George. Oh, shit! No! Your stupid fucking cactuses at the Texas Roadhouse damaged my golf cart. Pretty sure it's not my fault you decided to drive your stupid golf cart near my restaurant. It's not yours, dipshit. You didn't even build it. I had to pay someone to build it for you. Okay, guys, I'm gonna get off to take a nice and long nap while my advisor's to my presidential duties for me. What time are we getting on tomorrow? Well, I'm getting McDonald's at four, so how about like five o'clock? Okay, fat ass.